Today, back by popular demand, Matty is back <laughs> and we are experimenting on him. You love when he gives you his honest, just straight to the point opinions about fragrances. And today we're going to do blind testing of fragrances and he'll try to say whether the fragrance is cheap and designer. So this is one bracket or is it niche? Without knowing the bottle, anything, he'll just smell the fragrance and tell you whether this fragrance smells cheap or designer. So we might sm cheap or like cheaper or uh, niche. So we'll probably get some surprises in here. By the way, subscribe if you enjoy perfume and luxury content and let's jump into the first fragrance. Okay. Is this a cheap or designer fragrance or maybe let's separate them cheap designer or niche cheap designer or niche i mm -hmm. like that okay no, my i have to be honest yeah i want, to, I want to. to block my honesty <laughs> because i'm worried that i will offend this brand no we want you to be honest it's uh, my first impression was this is so cheap and fruity mm -hmm. that i am tempted to say it's cheap Okay. I'm just scared even saying these words now. Let's do a reveal. Three, two, one. Okay, it's cheap. Yes. <laughs> yes, thank God. <laughs> he now feels the pressure. <laughs> oh, but man. It is cheap tobacco, um, rich, warm, addictive from Zara. This is a great cheapie, in my opinion. But I do agree with the vanilla in here, it smells quite cheap. That's if you've ever smelled mm -hmm. like higher quality vanilla. Niche. Okay, that was it. Yeah, but if you haven't, mm -hmm. it's totally fine. Okay, my confidence is, is <laughs> yeah, a bit higher now, yeah. Okay. Now, I've purposefully tried to find fragrances that you I don't wear as often or like you wouldn't mm -hmm. know. Ah, you it, cheeky. Yeah, this to. is something better. Okay. Um, I'm just feeling my, my feeling a bit Your more confidence is yeah, there. Yeah. <laughs> well, I can imagine it could be niche. Hmm. And actually, because it's not so screaming, mm -hmm. probably I would say it is a niche fragrance. Mm, interesting. That is an exper um, interesting experiment because we sometimes think that spending more money will give us a better fragrance, but it might not necessarily be mm -hmm. the case. Obviously, niche good. fragrances, uh, they can be screamy, mm -hmm. uh, but I'm just gonna stick with designer because it's, okay. it, it doesn't impress me. It's 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 a nice fragrance. It's not very screamy, but still, it doesn't deserve a niche price Title. tag. Okay. It's a price tag or yeah, price tag. That's mm -hmm. how I put it. So what it is? What is it? <laughs> what is it? it is designer. Desi You're like, I am killing it. <laughs> You're literally killing it. So yeah, the money that you spent represents the reaction. I, guess. I have to start my own so YouTube far. channel. Exactly. So this is Zadig and Voltaire. This is her, and I do know what you mean it could be niche. But yeah, it is still designer. Mm -hmm. It's a very nice milky vanilla scent. Mm -hmm. So nice. Listen to my opinions. <laughs> okay, close your eyes. Mm -hmm. Are you ready? I'm ready. Well, uh, now I'm thinking logically you would naturally give me a niche fragrance. Now so I'm not even smelling about, about you. I'm doing to... it randomly. Yeah. Mm. This one is loud, much louder at least than two previous ones. That's why I'm leaning towards designer shelf, but it's very nice. I, I will stick with design. It could be a very nice designer fragrance for women. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll stick with this. I'm not surprised if it's going to be niche fragrance. Mm -hmm. I would, really it's nice. not cheap, but it's designer nice. It's a nice designer fragrance. So it would deserve a, a, a nice designer price tag. So this one is a niche one mm -hmm. actually. Yeah. It's Gaba number two of the Parfum Ground. Mm, okay. And it's, yeah, it's very different, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Very, very different. Feminine, but powerful, I would say. But yeah, you were right on the money that it could be niche. But it also could be very uh -huh. good, like jaw or something. Not far off then, but. Not far yeah. off. But yeah, you could smell the quality. So mm -hmm. actually, so far, you can smell the quality. Mm -hmm even though you don't know every single fragrance, yeah. yeah. All of them smell pretty kind of new to me. Mm -hmm. So, good bakes. Okay, it, close it your... No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're smiling. No, this is just... This is not a niche <laughs> fragrance. This is a designer 
very popular designer fragrance. It's a bit, it's quite screamy. So maybe it's, no, let's say- Ice cream. No, screamy, like, it's like <laughs> screamy. Yeah, it's screamy. I will stick with designer. Mm -hmm. I'm not surprised if it's going to be a cheap fragrance. Okay. I, actually, I just realized that saying designer is a safe a safe bet for me now because mm -hmm. I can go, you know, towards this. But it's not a niche fragrance. It's a niche fragrance. Don't buy this fragrance. <laughs> it's not worth the money. But this is not a niche fragrance. It's yeah. designer. Is it nice though? It's like, what you I say? like it. Yeah. yeah it's, it's designer cool. lower lower okay. price tag mm -hmm. d deserving. It is designer. It's alien <laughs> absolute. You love this scent. Yeah, I love this scent. But you think it smells cheap? Ah! Poor alien, absolute. But I love this one. Don't care. What it's a nice says. fragrance. I, yeah. I didn't say it's a bad fragrance. No, but I'm, it smells I'm, on the cheaper end. It yes. is designer though. Mm -hmm. oh, but the jasmine in here probably isn't very expensive. So because jasmine is such an expensive. In my opinion, note. it wouldn't deserve you know like 120, 150 pounds per bottle. Mm -hmm. Mm, but still, it's a very good fragrance, and and I like this fragrance. Mm -hmm. It's just like when I'm thinking about how much mm, would I pay for this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that's mm, yeah, where, that's where I'm putting yeah. it. So, okay. cool. Close your eyes again. Okay. It's nice. Mm -hmm. I can imagine that there might be women that like they love this kind of not very like very a skin fair. skin scent sort mm -mm. of. This is sort of fragrance that I I personally wouldn't spend money if it's a niche fragrance. Okay. Because it's not worth it for me. I, I want I want to be smelled. So if I spend that much money, I want to be smelled. Mm -hmm. But I can imagine it might be niche fragrance. I will stick with my decision. This is a niche fragrance. Okay. It is a niche fragrance. Aqua di Parma below my death. Boom! Subscribe to my new YouTube channel. Link below. <laughs> fragrance reviews. Yeah. I love this one, but I do agree, it's more of a quieter scent, but on the skin it's louder than on the uh, paper, so I'm surprised that it's so quiet, it's literally, yeah, very, very subtle, but on the skin it jumps off the skin much more. Mm -hmm. I personally would spend money on it, but you I would, yeah, know. But yeah, but I, yeah. I know so you are that kind of person that would, <laughs> <laughs> that would spend money on a fragrance that yeah, only you, spend you money can on smell. It, yeah. But yeah, this is a wonderful scent, but he doesn't think it's worth the money. That is what it's important here. Did you prepare any cheap fragrances? This, my uh, immediate thought, designer, very popular designer, like to just women grab it, grab and go, but but it's uh, it's very very sweet. I think it might be cheap fragrance. I'm stick yeah. I'm sticking with cheap, but I have to say I love this scent. So if it's a cheap fragrance, then buy it. Then buy it now. <laughs> okay. What is, what is it? It is a cheap fragrance. It's a Baccarat Rouge tube, mm -hmm. Ariana Grande, the cloud. Ah, it's very good. It's very good. Mm -hmm. I was expecting that you might say it's niche because it's a dupe for Baccarat Rouge, but ah. you're just. Mm, you're just on it. I'm impressed with myself. Yeah, you're so good. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. I don't know, I'm confused. Now my confidence is not so high because I don't like this fragrance, that's why, but maybe somebody would uh, maybe somebody would pay a niche niche price for it. <laughs> no, I think uh. It would, for me, Space. it would be okay, oh, an okay designer fragrance. Very okay, meaning less than okay. Mm. <gasps> Hide in a corner. <laughs> it's reckless, Roger. I love this. Personal thing. taste. Yes. Pers uh, this, this is purely a matter of personal taste. Uh, as I said at the beginning, some I can imagine somebody would be impressed with this. Mm -hmm. This is just not my taste. Yeah, to you, it's like designer worthy. Mm -hmm. To me, this is a very nice, like marshmallowy, beautiful mm. feminine scent, but not to his. Not worth the money, in his opinion. This one is a challenge. I love it. You I love it? I love it. I love it. It almost smells like a men's uh, designer fragrance. Mm -hmm. Amazing designer scent. Okay. Would you like to smell it on a woman? No? Yeah, still, yeah, that, that's what I, I, I love when Monica wears men's designer fragrances, by the way. It doesn't smell like masculine, it's like, I look at scents differently, not sex. 
so strict. Rigid, yeah, yeah. yeah. This is a nice designer scent. That's design. how it smells like. Hmm. Good for women This as well. is a mm -hmm. niche scent, so a more expensive one. Yeah. But it's also, that's why I threw it in here, because it's a men's scent, but I think it smells amazing on women. Wow. So you got it really, really right. So it's Gisada Ambassador for Men. Yeah, um, that is the name of it. Mm -hmm. This scent, it's got a magnetic card. Very it's nice. Niche, very nice. And it does smell designer, though. It does smell mm -hmm. designer. So I would say get it at discounters, because I've seen it at discounters. It's a great one. And yeah, it just smells like on women it would be like a powerful powerful mm -hmm. scent yeah great yeah. first impression designer i will stick with designer and i don't have many comments now because maybe my nose is getting yeah, confused yeah. now it's a nice designer scent it is a cheapy oh that's a cheapy yeah it's a very cheap fragrance like i thought it smells sweeter mm, see it smells different, I think, on the This is like must have for every woman. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to yeah, wave in front of your eyes. <laughs> yeah, this is like a amazing layering scent as well. Mm -hmm. uh, it's very cheap, but yeah, it's my guilty pleasure scent because it's just quite intense and sweet. But yeah, it does sound, smell designer, not as cheap as it is. Mm -hmm. I just realized that I, for most of them I said designer, meaning that I went safe. Do you have one more fragrance? Yes. Let's go one more and I'll be more like okay. either okay. or now she's going to give me designer. <laughs> no, there's too much quality here. This is designer. Uh, this, is design. this is designer. Me again. Everything is designer. This is niche. This is a niche scent. No way. It's a cheap fragrance. It, it is designer. It's a designer. Designer. No, a very good designer scent. Mm. Ooh. Then the scent is worth. Yeah, go, go for this one. Very good. Yeah. I like where it is. Smells really nice. Very clean and, yeah, mm -hmm. very work appropriate, I would say. Amazing. Yeah, amazing. Mm -hmm. So, overall, I think we've concluded that what you spend, that's what you get. Like, mm -hmm. uh, you know, usually for most of them, you smell yeah. something and it smells either cheap or designer or niche. So it is true that, you know, niche is probably a bit more complex, a bit more different. Uh -huh. Designer is like safe and cheap is okay, but slightly maybe cheaper smelling. So yeah, yeah it's good, a good hypothesis mm -hmm. that we have proven today. All right. If you enjoy having Machi on this channel, give me a thumbs up so we know to make more videos like this. And follow me on Insta and Monica underscore Joch, where I post a bit more about my life and perfume diary. And we'll see you all again very soon. Bye, guys. Bye.